In this video, we will cover the installation of the SureSpeed meter and delivery system on a John Deere XP Pro row unit. Before you begin, verify that you have all the required parts indicated in your installation instructions. First, we'll start by removing any of the optical parts from the row unit. Gauge wheels, scrapers, opening discs, seed meter, seed firmer, seed tube guard, and any wiring harnesses. Next, we will install the new parallel arm hardware for the SureSpeed meter. Remove the upper parallel arm bolt, nut, washer, and bushing. It is recommended to only remove one side of the row unit at a time. Reinstall with the new parts located in the hardware bag. Only the OEM parallel arm bushing and outside washer will be reused. Repeat this process for the opposite parallel arm. Next, we will install the seed tube guard. Install the new seed tube guard by sliding it into the shank from the front. Insert the one inch by a quarter inch bolt and attach the quarter inch nut. It is recommended to use a blue Loctite or an equivalent thread lock. Do not over torque the nut. To install the seed tube guard wing, gently pinch the rear of the wing and push it into the guard. The seed delivery rail will be installed next. Start by removing any dirt or debris from the inside of the shank. Insert two spacer sleeves on each side of the delivery rail. Insert the delivery rail from the top of the shank until the lower hook on the rail is engaged with the lower shank pin. Be sure to visually confirm engagement. Next, install the clevis pin and hairpin clip through the top of the delivery rail. The delivery rail should not be able to be removed once the pin is installed. Next, install the rear bracket and bracket spacer. If there is an existing spacer, be sure to remove it. Clip the bracket spacer into the rear bracket. Ensure that the holes align. Attach the rear bracket and the original bolt in this location, or if there's not an existing bolt, use a provided M10 bolt and washer in the mounting kit. Leave the bolt loose at this time to allow for adjustment later on. Next, install the SureSpeed delivery tube. Slide the delivery tube in the top of the shank until it is resting on the delivery rail spring and is inside the seed tube guard wing. If the cabling has been installed prior, connect the row CAN cable to the delivery tube motor at this time. The SureSpeed meter will be installed next. Place the meter onto the bushings we previously installed. Then, while gently Pushing down on the meter, slide the rear bracket forward as much as possible while still allowing the meter to rest on the rear bracket. Now tighten the bolt to secure the rear bracket. When properly adjusted, there will be a slight click as the meter engages with the rear bracket. Secure the sure speed meter with the latch. The J hook on the latch can be adjusted by rotating it clockwise or counterclockwise. Once the J-hook is adjusted, set it by tightening the jam nut. If the cabling has been installed prior, connect the row CAN cable to the meter motor at this time. Now reinstall the CCS hose. Lastly, install the vacuum elbow provided. 
Cut the existing vacuum hose to the desired length. Install the new vacuum elbow onto the hose. Be aware the elbow has left hand threads. Push the elbow onto the meter. Now you will be able to successfully install a sure speed meter and delivery system on a John Deere XP Pro row unit. If you'd like to see more short tutorials from AgLeader, please subscribe to our YouTube channel.